Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to make a tulip, one, two, three tulips, yeah? So this is one of your suggestions. Last week I uploaded one of my flower demos and I asked you, you can suggest a few flowers to me so I can record a few new videos and I'm going to include your flowers, yeah? So this is the first one, yeah? I'm going to make one, two, three flowers, yeah? They are going to be yellow, red, a little bit orange, yeah? Something um, similar to this, yeah? Um, I have already sketched more or less one, two, three flowers, yeah? And um, some people, they asked me about my palette, yeah? So this is my palette, yeah? It's a little bit messy because I have been teaching online and I couldn't clean it yet, yeah? Anyway, it's more or less this, yeah? It's, uh, and I use all, all my brushes, they are synthetic, yeah? So, uh, and I have all my colors here, yeah? You can see the video description, there is a list of colors, yeah? It's more or less this here, yeah? Okay, so this paper is cold pressed, yeah? Um, 140 pounds or 300 grams, yeah? Uh, and I'm going to use a few photos like this, just to, to understand the flower shape, yeah? Uh, what's important here is to understand uh, more or less it's how many petals or I can, I don't need to suggest all petals, yeah? But I need to suggest some of them, yeah? Um, and I need to understand when, uh, where is the center of the flower, more or less, yeah? So I think here it's a little bit darker, yeah? So I can show some sort of, uh, it's not going to be a flat, a flat painting, yeah? If I understand that here is darker, so, and I have light and dark, so I can add a three-dimensional um, feeling to my paintings, yeah? Okay. So uh, I'm going to wet my paper a little bit, yeah? So clean water here, yeah? Uh, clean water, yeah? Just, uh, okay. And then let me start adding some pigment here. I told you that I'm going to paint something a little bit yellow, yeah? So, let me just mix a few yellows here and a little bit of orange, yeah? Hmm, let me see. So I start from, I start from the bottom of the flower to the top, so I can have more shadows here, yeah? So it's very important your initial brush stroke, yeah? So you just add the pigment and then you soften, yeah? You see, so I can create some curved thing, yeah? And then here, yeah, you see. Mm -hmm. And a little bit of orange here. I can suggest another petal here. Remember, inside the flower is dark, a little bit dark, unless I have a very strong light here, but I don't have, yeah? So it can be a little bit darker inside the flower. Yeah, so just to remember, yeah, once you are painting the flower shape, just to make one brush stroke, yeah, because this is a big petal, yeah, so, uh, and it's darker here, yeah, it's darker, so I can show shadow and light here, yeah, okay, so let me work a little bit with my background here, I'm going to mix a few greens, yeah, and let me soften here, yeah. Mm -hmm. Here. You see, so I have soft edges, okay. I want to leave a few soft edges so I can have some connection between background and flower, yeah. So, again, um, I can make one a little bit more red, yeah. So, let me see. I'm mixing red and yellow. Mm -hmm. A little bit of rose mother, yeah? So yeah, just one brush stroke and then I can suggest the flower shape here, yeah? Uh -huh. I can use either a 
round brush or a flat brush, it's both, they work, yeah? You see here. Uh -huh. So darker here, so I can show some, a few shadows, yeah? Uh -huh. So let me come back here, I can add a few more darks here. Yeah. Let me shape my flower. Mm -hmm. So one of them can be a little bit purple here, yeah, darker, yeah, and more purple, why not, yeah. As I added the water, you see I have many, many soft edges, yeah, so, yeah, it's okay. Just uh, the center of the flower is here, yeah. It's more or less, yeah. Um, let me come back to my background here, yeah. So darker, yeah, here darker. And then let me lift out something here. And then, yeah. So background again, here, background, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me soften here, yeah. Let me soften. And then I can keep on adding darks to my flowers, yeah? So just uh, a little bit of orange here, yeah? And just adding darks. Uh -huh. And here I can suggest one petal, a darker one, yeah? Yeah, just to just to add a few details here, yeah, a few details, so, uh -huh. a little bit like this, yeah. Uh -huh. And then here, darker, so, darker. Why not? I can add another one here. I haven't sketched it, but it's okay, yeah? I just sketch the main shapes, yeah. I like to add something in the middle of the process. So I can suggest the one that is more just suggested here. And I can repeat a little bit this yellow here. Like, let's see, we can add another one here. Maybe, yeah, so I lift and I suggest something that is more distant, yeah. Yeah, and then I can come back here and I can shape this flower, yeah, darker. Darker here. soften here. Yeah. So another flower here. Tiny one, a small one, yeah. A little bit like this, yeah. I can lift out this shape, yeah. And I can destroy edges, yeah.
I can suggest a stem here. It's very, very wet here. Yeah, I can lift. Let me add more darks here. I can keep on working with the shape, yeah, just uh, lifting and suggesting more petals, yeah. more details here. Yeah, that's what I do sometimes. I, I add another shape and I just blend it with background, yeah? So uh, it's okay just to suggest there is something more distant here, yeah. Mm -hmm. So a little bit like this. And then I come back here and I, I try to suggest this flower again, yeah. So let me see, darks, yeah, so. I can draw attention to these flowers, yeah, so. And maybe some of them are going to be blended into the background, yeah. I still want to add something here. Mix it with my background, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Ja. Yeah, better. And here too. Good. And then let me come back here. And suggest a stem here. Darks, so it's going to pop up, yeah. So, yeah, I can suggest something in my background, yeah. Darks, darks here. Uh -huh. Yeah. So yeah, I want to suggest, just suggest here something. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. Better. Yeah. Good. Let me come back here as I want here my, my focal point. Yeah, so let's see. And then, mm -hmm, yeah. And then a little bit of purple here. Just, yeah. Let me suggest more here, yeah. And then I can suggest I stand here just working with negative and positive shape, you see. Oh, it's more blended here. Yeah. There is another one here. Hmm, yeah. Uh, as I use some blue here, there is some blue. I'm going to repeat a little bit this blue here. And, yeah. And then a little bit of blue, yeah. Just to make a connection between these two blues. Yeah, so. And here, just a little bit like this, yeah. Mm-hmm, okay. So I can lift out here and suggest a leaf or something that that looks like a leaf. Yeah, just a shape, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Then just one more here. 
one more green yeah and let me make it bigger and thicker yeah yeah few darks here and there let's blend it yeah so and a few more details here yeah as one is overlapping another flower so it's i need a few shadows here yeah so let me see mm -hmm. Just let me soften here. And just a little bit of yellow, yeah. Good. And then I can finish, I can sign it. Yes, so hope you have enjoyed yeah so thank you very much yeah for watching it yeah bye bye